Charlie here. What's up, everybody? We are in the parking lot of Academy. We're waiting for them to open. As soon as they open, I'm just going to go look around because ain't no money to buy anything. <laughs> I'm just kidding. They got a sale going on. But after this, we're going to do some uh, perch fishing. Try to catch some bait for this catfish. So, um, appreciate you guys watching. Stay tuned. We'll see what we can catch on night crawlers. All right, everybody. Hope you can hear me. I just left Academy. It's a little windy out here, so hopefully you can hear me. We're going to do some uh, perch sunfish fishing. Just to see if I get some catfish bait. All I'm using is a very small 8 oct. If you can see how tiny it is, it's an 8 oct Eagle Claw bait holder hook. I'm using a Mr. Crappie um, weighted float there, slip float, that you can move up and down. And of course, I got the all super awesome Zipco Splash. Y'all have seen it in tons of videos where it caught lots of freaking big fish with a little tiny tackle. Again, all I'm gonna use is uh, some night crawlers. I do have uh, some uh, crappie magnet slab bites just to see what happens. So uh, we'll hit a few spots today. See if I catch some uh, any size panfish. Get some uh, bait. All right, I am coming up on spot number one. It's been about I don't know, close to a year probably. I haven't fished in here, uh, but after all this water that we had, I figured I'd give it a try. It looks pretty clean. Actually, it's. A lot shallower than what it usually is. So I might stand up at that dam and throw some lines out. It's pretty shallow. Actually, I see them right there. Oh, it should be good. I don't know if y'all can see them there. Oh, yeah. Walk over here. Woo. Make sure I don't fall in the water. Don't fall in the water, Charlie. It's definitely really shallow. I can kind of somewhat see the bottom there. Actually, I can see the bottom there. Some trash. Go over here, see what this side looks like. See the water flowing here. Definitely a lot deeper. Ooh, something just took off there. You see that? Probably a cop. Oh well, I'll probably chunk one on each side. All right, everybody, we are rigged up. We got them both. The little chunks of night crawlers there. Uh, it actually looks a little deeper over there, but I'm gonna start here to see what happens. If anything, I can move right across on either side. The only thing here, you just can't go on that embankment. It's part of that property. But other than that, we'll see if we catch some fish. Nope, there's a dead creek chub. I've caught bait before. That's pretty cool. All right, we're on, guys. As soon as it landed, we didn't get the cast in, but look at that. Look at that, so look like he got some herpes. You got herpes? I guess I'm gonna move my basket over here. Look at the size of that little bitty hook in that little mouth. I do see some carp in there as well. Let me go grab the bucket. I'm gonna cast far, that's where I casted last time. And as soon as it hit, like boom! If it goes, there it goes. Come on, buddy. There's some carp or buffalo, it's pretty big, but I can't see them too, too well. But those have been known to take some worms. There it is. Boom. I'm cool. Woohoo. Woo, look at that pretty sucker right there. That sucker's pretty. A little hook, something else to get up. The good thing that they won't swallow it. Because they got a little baby mouse.
Still using that same little worm. Look how tiny that is. See that? Nice, perfect size. Oh, this one putting up a fight. Oh, it came off right there. <laughs> oh, no. That was crazy. That was a nice one. All right, try it again. Jeez, it just landed and it disappeared. put a pellet on here and I wasn't paying attention when it landed and the pellets gone well wow. all right I got a double pellet on here we'll see if that does the trick I'm gonna try to film this all the way from the cast all right here we go see there's like a carp blowing bubbles or something all right there she goes To get anything's attention. There it is. Something's nibbling. Whoop. Too fast. Let it eat, Charlie. Uh oh, I think I got one over here. Uh oh. Let's see. Let's see. No! Man. I guess I need to use one rod. Yeah, I think the other one might be hooked. I'm not sure. Let's find out. It's acting strange. Let's find out. Are you on there, fishy? Are you on there, fishy? Nope. Psych, he said. I don't know if I can see that buffalo in front of me. I'm going to try to put the line in front of his face. Massive buffalo. See if he'll take the worm. And I think he swam off. Did you pick up that big old worm? No way. I just threw it in there. Look at that sucker. Woo! Oh, beautiful freaking fish. Beautiful. Look at, look at the size of that worm. Woo. And again on the big worm. I guess I need to start using big worms. Another one. Look at that. Look at that. Woo. Got him. Got him. Got, woo. Took him's, uh, Took him, what you call it? Skiing, look at that. Woohoo! Look at that, guys. Turned him up today. He got hooked us on the side a bit. See that big old worm. Well, since this one got fouled hook, he don't count. But he's pretty, though. You lucky, buddy. Got foul hook. Bye. Follow the rules. Got him. Got him. Woo! Look at that. This one got caught beautifully. Beautifully. This partner a second ago got foul hook, so I had to let him go. Oh no. He definitely swallowed this one. Oh, I got him, yeah. Finally, little baby. Finally, look at that. Take him in. All right, we're going to go ahead and uh, pack up and head to the second spot. Came here, caught a few, caught about six or seven. You can see them there in the bucket. Uh, I let one go because I foul hooked it and lost a few. I actually lost a whole bunch, but uh, we'll try spot number two and number three. You guys stay tuned for the second half of this video. You guys are going to love it. Trust me.